Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And I am super excited to go over this ultra clean 2022 Chrysler Pacifica Limited Hybrid. This is stock number 14651Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Chrysler Pacifica and minivan headquarters. This 2022 Chrysler Pacifica Limited Hybrid it comes with the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. It is hooked up with two motors and puts out 260 horsepower. It's also combined with the continuously variable automatic transmission. It's going to get you 82 miles per gallon equivalent. It has a 32 mile all electric range and when it's on just the gas engine, it's going to get you 30 miles per gallon average. This is a one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax out of Washington. This vehicle has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. Inside, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the options and just give you the most accurate representation that I can of the vehicle. Ceramic gray clear coat is the paint, co or is the paint color Paint code is PDN. I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and SCB and minivan walkarounds on YouTube and stay current on our ever-changing and vast minivan inventory as it changes daily and you do not miss, want to miss out on gems like this one. Comes with the painted and polished aluminum wheels. These are 17-inch wheels and it has Yokohama Avid S34 tires. These are 235 65R17s and they have just about all the tread left on them. Only 3,000 some miles on this vehicle. This is where you um, charge up your vehicle. Now I believe it takes you about a little over two hours with a 240 and about 12 hours with a 120 volt plug-in to charge this up fully. LED headlamps, running lights, on there as well as LED fog lamps. We'll turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. The front bumper is absolutely perfect. The grill is in excellent condition as well. This one does have the 360 camera on it too. And the hood is in excellent shape. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there. Looks really, really good. Passenger side front fender is absolutely perfect. And the passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. As you go down this side of this 2022 Chrysler Pacifica Limited Hybrid, just take note of how clean the body is, and once again, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away, or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the vehicle, hear the vehicle, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises, and you can make a smart, and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. Now, if this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, that Brett sent you, and then I can keep doing these videos for our customers each and every day. But if our salesmen don't know that you're watching the videos, then they got no reason to keep me around. But uh, back tires have just as much tread as the front tires and four wheel disc brakes, of course, on the Pacificas. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, rear bumper is in fantastic condition. No dents or dings in there. It does have the backup parking sensors. The rear gate is in excellent condition as well. I didn't see any dents or dings in there. And you do get the LED lights back here, which are a really nice feature. This is a power lift gate. Back storage area is very nice and clean. These are manual fold-down seats, so I'll show you how those work. Normally, if the headrest is up like that, you just pull that one, pull one, and then two, and then these fall back into place, and you can see just how nice and flat that they go. You want to keep this strap out, so when you want to put them back, you can just kind of flip it up and pull that up like so. You do get a storage back here. There is your charging um, bag, so it has your charger in it for your... Uh, hybrid system for the battery. Carpeting is very nice and clean. And to get this rear gate down, you just press this button right here. It'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent. 
Shuts nice and solidly, and as we come around the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side. No major dents or dings on the rear quarter or door. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is just as nice as the rest. Once again, only 3,000 some miles on this vehicle, so this, run, this one is really like new all the way around, really nice and clean. Driver's side doors look great. Does have the heated power mirrors, blind spot monitoring, and built-in directional signals. You get the power sliding side doors. Second row quad seating with the captain's chairs. There are no rips or tears on these seats. You get the white piping on there or light gray piping. Factory floor mat that goes all the way across back here because this one doesn't have the stow and go with the hybrid. You don't, you don't, can't get the stow and go. Uh, these seats do slide forward so that you can get to that third row seat though. And the third row seats are in fantastic condition as well. You do get a USB and USB-C plug-in on the passenger side. These seats fold back up like so. And side pair airbags on the front seats. And to get these doors back, you just press that button. There are rear air controls right there too. You can see that door shuts nice and solidly. Up front, the limited package gives you the black leather seats, the bucket seats up front here as well with that same gray piping. Look really good. This vehicle's never been smoked in. Power driver's seat with lumbar. Factory floor mats up front. Auto headlamps, tilt, telescopic steering wheel, power windows, locks, and mirrors. You get the nice wood grain trim on there. And this one does have the Harman Kardon pretty, Harman Kardon premium sound system. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, radio, and everything this one has to offer on the interior. And like I said, only 3,402 miles on this one. You get the nice big instrument cluster, digital speedometer, compass, um, range to empty, uh, miles per gallon, all that good stuff uh, on there as well. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean. This one comes with the leather wrapped heated steering wheel. You get cruise controls and adaptive cruise controls on the right. Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. Audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. You can see you get that really nice wood grain trim around the instrument cluster and radio. And the black trim around the radio, the Uconnect 10.1, Uconnect 5 touchscreen radio. It does have factory navigation system. There is Highway 41, so that is working very <clears throat> nicely. Excuse me. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, as well as Bluetooth, USB, and AUGS and Alexa hookups. You get your climate controls on here as well. And uh, that includes the dual climate controls. It also includes your heated and cooled seat buttons and your heated steering wheel controls. You get all your different apps on here. So I'm not gonna go through everything. I'm just gonna kinda show you everything that's on there. A lot of this stuff is just links to different parts of the radio. You do get Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. I believe those are wireless now. And then you get your cameras here, which we'll go to in just a second and uh, there are all the rest of the apps. So your cameras are really great. You get the surround view camera, you get the backup cam, you get a wide view of the back, you get a wide view of the front, and a narrow view of the front, and then your regular backup camera. Now if you had a receiver hitch on here, which they do not recommend for towing, you could get hooked up to your uh, receiver hitch. Um, they don't recommend towing with the hybrid vehicle. Anyways, all the Cameras are working very nicely, and down here are your more tactile volume tune and climate controls. You also have your parallel and perpendicular park assist, parking sensors, lane departure warning, and your stability control and your hazard lights. Down here you get your dual climate controls, your um, transmission control right there for that continuously variable transmission, and your electronic parking brake. This one also has the wireless cell phone charge pad, two USBs, two USB-Cs, and an AUX jack. And you get the keyless entry with the power lift gate, remote start, and side door buttons. You also get a storage area here. You get USB, USB-C, and a 12-volt power point, as well as some coin holders. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition as well. No rips or tears on there. And then you also get the power sunroof with the second row fixed glass Vista roof which is a really nice feature. Once again, that front glass is powered. 
map lights up there, assist and SOS buttons, and your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. Let's officially start this up and take a look under the hood. And because it is in um, electric mode right now, um, it is officially started. You get a digital speedometer, outside temp, compass display, and once again, that instrument cluster, very nice and clean. Let's go take a look under the hood, as well as at those LED lights up front. And now it actually, the engine did start right now. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this van all the way around. I think it is in fantastic condition like new all the way around. And under the hood, we have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine uh, combined with the dual motor hybrid system, 260 horsepower. 82 miles per gallon equivalent, 32 miles all electric, and 30 miles per gallon on just the gas engine. And the engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. And you can see all those orange cables have to do with the electrical system. So they're kind of letting you know not to touch those. And um, everything else in yellow is your normal maintenance stuff. And this vehicle has been fully safety and inspected. It has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. And it is 100% ready to go. There is the emission sticker. And like I said, I would highly recommend this van from a quality and condition standpoint. I would ship this one back to Washington, California, Texas, New York, Florida. Whoever's going to get this van is going to absolutely love it because it is in fantastic condition like new love those led tail lamps that go all the way across there and uh to see more pictures of this absolutely beautiful van go to that website right there summitauto.com full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle all at summitauto.com and if you want to check out more hd videos you can go to youtube.com slash summit auto click the bell notifications get updates on the videos i do each and every day as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and minivan walkarounds on YouTube and stay current on our ever-changing and vast inventory here at Summit Auto so you do not miss out on gems like this one. In fact, in a second you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Chrysler Pacifica videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we are super excited to help you with this Ultra Clean 2022. Chrysler Pacifica Hybrid Limited in ceramic gray clear coat. Thank you so much for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. And have a great day.